What's up, guys? It's me, your badass host, Raven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Heart Gold walkthrough. Okay, so, not very happy about what happened in the last episode. Now, if you guys didn't, re my, didn't watch that or anything, good, because that was uh, an embarrassment of, uh, of, a, of a Pokemon gym battle. Now, in our last episode, yes, we did win our fifth badge right here. Look at that. We skipped two trainers and went straight for the seventh trainer right here. But, technically, it was him that beat himself. Now, we had to struggle a lot, and I mean a lot, to defeat this guy. But, yeah, he did it all by himself by using struggle and all that crud. Because we literally deplete, de depleted his de dugong of uh, any kind of moves right there. So, yeah. Good for Bryce. Good for Bryce. Maybe he should give himself his own badge right there. First time ever in my channel that that's ever happened. Um, not so happy, as you guys can probably tell, because yes, uh, yeah, I like to beat trainers. I like to over, uh, I like to use my power over them. And I had a lot of power, but no. I haven't even trained my Pokemon just yet. So let's go, let's go right ahead and, uh, let's go right ahead and start, uh, moving on to the next part of this adventure. Now, after defeating the next gym battle, uh, actually, our mom has left us quite a few gifts. So talk to this guy. Good day, a package from her mom. She gives us some Yaki berries. And, well, that's one. Let's see, another package, a silk scarf, which will actually help our normal type attacks, and uh, here's another package, char tea berries. Seriously, Mom, you could have given us something e easier or better, and here's another one. We got ourselves a moonstone, which we could be using on another Pokemon, and no further packages. Okay, so let's go right ahead and talk to this guy, and... Let's go ahead and buy some Pokeballs. No, not really. Uh, we can actually buy Ultra Balls after the fifth battle, but what I'm going to be trying to do is I'm actually going to have to try and, you know, buy myself some, uh, some revives right there, because that's probably what I should have done in the get-go. Yeah, a lot of my Pokemon fainted, and, uh, yeah, not so proud about that stuff. So now I'm going to buy 13 Super Potions right there. And, uh, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. Eh, a few repels don't hurt. Let's get 10, and there we go. We've used up practically our, all our money, so now it's time to move on right here. Okay, so let's move on. We don't need to do anything else. We can't go in here yet until later on. They actually incorporated something different onto this storyline right here. And, well, we're going to be going west now of Ecrotech City now. Originally, we would normally go west and take care of the whole situation with like the sick Pokemon and all that stuff, but we wanted to change it up here since we are playing Pokemon Heart Gold. And well, there is an item right there. Now, most of these Pokemon trainers are going to be just a little bit easier because, yeah, you haven't battled them. Um, what else? Uh, they're right around your level, right after defeating uh, Morty of this of the Ecrotech City Gym. So just be aware of that right there. So uh, that's exactly what I'm going to do. I'm just going to start battling, trying to evolve all my Pokemon right here. Fly high into the sky, my beloved bird Pokemon. Okay. Maximum effort. Let's go. Here he comes out with a Doe Duo and Fluffold looking uh, buffy as always. Getting this Thundershock right here. Look at that. Yeah, buddy. And it's grown to level 26. And, well, it's coming out with another doo doo. So let's go ahead and switch out our Pokemon. Let's go to Nessie right here and give it a little bit of love since it fainted in the last episode. And let's get the Surf attack right here. Yeah, we literally went into a gym battle with just level 20 Pokemon against level 30 Pokemon. And they literally, and I mean literally, used rest so many times. It was so annoying. Oh my god. Let's fry these birds. Look at this. Flame wheel does the trick. Yes, sir. Okay. And uh, Toby has been defeated. I am happy. See? Easy. Very, very easy. And, well, we're going to be grabbing this apricorn right here. And, of course, I'm just, like, moving around right here. Taking off my shoes. And, yes, we have gotten ourselves a white apricorn. Always nice. And, well, let's go right ahead and start finding some more Pokemon trainers right here battling every single one of these guys. Okay. So, 
as you guys already know, I am playing Pokemon Let's Go Pikachu. And I'm still continuing my adventure right there on Pokemon X. As you guys already know, I got Fluffled onto that, uh, that walkthrough as well, just because, well, you know, it's a pretty good Pokemon, right? It, it's a very good Pokemon to actually use, and, uh, well, everything's going well. I did take a, I did take a month off from Pokemon Heart Gold because of certain situations and all that stuff, and then plus me being a little lazy. But we're back at it, and, uh, well, I've recorded enough episodes to cover a full month, maybe two months, which is good because, uh, you kind of need that. When this whole pandemic started, I remember putting a lot of my walkthrough videos through scheduled times, which was good because it like it made me feel like an actual channel with planned stuff. But, you know, I kind of, kind of, kind of, kind of got a little uh, burnt out, so kind of did not record more episodes. So here we go, our first official battle with Relic. And yes, I did teach it Shadow Ball a few episodes back, or maybe last episode, and wow. Go figure, we're gonna get paralyzed again, you asshole Pokemon. God dang it, come on, Relic. Oh, uh, God. Come on. Time to finish this guy off. Let's go. Dark Command Man nearly defeats this guy and. Really? God damn it. I really hate these Pokemon right now. I'm really, really getting annoyed. Uh, okay, Hercules. Let's go. Let's do some damage right here. Shadow Claw. It nearly takes this guy out. And really, we're gonna get... Oh, God, I really hate these Pokemon. I really do. Brick Break, come on. Same process. Finish this little bastard off. That's right. Okay, alrighty. And he's coming out with a Psyduck. And, well, Flood Bolt to the winner. To the victory right here. Here we go, Flood Bolt. And Psyduck looking all mean and everything. It kind of sucks that we can't buy Ice Punch, Fire Punch, or Thunder Punch. It would have worked right. It, it would have worked well with uh, Fluffle right here, but no, no. Pokemon had to be stupid about this. And she's like, "You're really good with Pokemon. Boys give me items after battle. Sometimes they give me too much." Yes, I'm gonna register your number because you're gonna give me some pretty good items right there too. Okay, so that's good. And, well, let's see. Now it's time to heal our Pokemon. Because, uh, well, it's always nice to. And yes, our last two Paralysis heals. There we go. And let's get that to Relic right there. And, well, let's see. What else? What else are we going to do right here? Oh, yeah, we're going to use a Repel because... No, I do not want to get attacked by any Pokemon. Chances are we might we might see the legendary beast again. Uh, I think it was in our like two episodes ago. We actually got to see both of beasts. One of them on screen, and the other one off screen. One the the one off screen was uh, of course Ante. On screen is Raikou, and yep, it's a pretty good experience, I guess. And so let's go again, Shadow Ball for the win. And this Hoppip has no chance. Let's continue on with this whole Shadow Ball Palooza right there. Look at that. And she's going to be coming out with a Skip Bloom, so let's go with Cinder right here. And finish everybody off. Okay, here we go. Flame Wheel. Let's go. Flame Wheel does the trick. And we're continuing on. Yes. Okay, alrighty. Alright, so there's another trainer that we saw right here. And... Nope, that was probably the trainer right there. Okay, so let's go ahead and continue on battling this guy right here. Let me let me try something I learned today. Okay, alrighty. What do you got? School kid Chad wants to battle, and he's coming with his Mr. Mime. I will, of course, go with Shadow Ball because, yes, Psychic-type Pokemon right here. And it's super effective, but not that strong. And look at that, it learned Shadow Ball. Won't be effective against me, because, it, yeah, still normal type Pokemon, buddy. And so, let's go again. Shadow Ball. That's right. For the win. Alrighty. Again, trying to level up my relic here. Huh. Is that the... Is that thing the po Pokedex? Have you met Professor Oak? Huh. That's way cool. I have a dream of becoming a Pokemon researcher like po Professor Oak. May I please have your phone number? I, we, we should chat about Professor Oak. It looks, look, looks some fun. 
Sure, why not? Sure, why not? Okay, so we registered this guy's phone number. It's always good. Time to move on right here, guys. And, well, what does the science say? Trainer tips. If a Pokemon is trying to evolve, you can stop it. Press B during the evolution. That startles the Pokemon and stops the, its evolution. Pretty cool. Very, very cool. Alright, so we're moving on right here. And, well, our repel has worn off. And something does happen right here. Route 39. And this guy, in the middle of the road, notices us. He's like, Baoba. That's his name. Oh! What, you, what, what are you holding? What you're holding is what they call a Pokedex. Haven't seen one of those in ages. My name is Baoba. I used to run the Safari Zone in the in Fuchsia City, but uh, it was becoming out of date with new entertainment options coming out. I decided, decided to go overseas to learn the newest technology and open a state-of-the-art state of the art Safari Zone in Cyanwood City. It may be more than a, uh, than a coincidence that we are chatting. Why don't we register each other's phone numbers at the Pokemon Gear? I can give you a call once the Safari Zone is open before I can uh, I call anyone else. Do you want to register? Yes, I do. Okay, so in Pokemon Heart Gold and Soul Silver, they do add an extra layer to Signwood City. You guys are going to be very excited once it all pops out. So that is that, and well, let's continue on our adventure right here. Let's go ahead and grab this Apricorn. And... Well, look at that. Green Apricorn. This is pretty nice. And I think there's an item uh, close by right here. Let's see. There should be an item right here. There's a... Uh, Moo Moo Milks, uh, Mill Tanks and all that stuff. And here we found ourselves a TM60 Drain Punch. A very nice move. Very good fighting type move. It's kind of like Absorb with a Punch. Hence the, hence the name. Drain Punch. Okay, so let's go here in the Moo Moo uh, building right here. Talk to this guy. My metal tank ain't giving me my milk. This here, this here, uh, well, this here farm's got a famous milk. Most everyone wants to drink. It will give me lots of milk to uh, feed it. Uh, lots of berries, I reckon. What the hell? Our milk, uh, our milk even goes out to Kanto. So if our mill tank won't give us any milk, we're in trouble. Well, let's go ahead and see what what the what the issue is with this whole mill tank. So here we are inside the barn, and this mill tank right here is sick, and she needs a lot of orange berries. And I think we only got like two, so here we go. Give it an orange berry. Here we go. Give it again. Okay, blue. Give it an orange berry. All right. Okay, so we got a little bit more. Yep. And yeah, we have no more orange berries. I believe you have to give it like at least five or seven. I could be wrong. Comment down below, guys, to let me know how many. That way I can collect them. Now, let's continue back to our adventure right here. And, uh, well, would you look at that? This person right here is looking at us all cockeyed and everything. Let me see what your Pokemon are capable of. Alrighty. Let's do it. So, here we go. Psychic Nelson wants the battle. Coming out with a Slowpoke. I got the move for you. Shadow Ball. For the win, nearly does it, and here comes that tackle attack. Not so strong. Let's get it again. Look at that. Easy, easy, lemon squeezy. And, well, let's go ahead and switch out. Let's give a little bit of the love to our Pokemon right here. Now our Pokemon's levels are a little leveled up, or like evened up right here. Let's go with a Thundershock. Alrighty, the Slowpoke has nothing. Look at that. Okay, so our Pokemon are doing so well. I'm actually happy. So. Let's go ahead and do this now. I kind of want to do this. I want to give it the. I want to give Eevee the uh, Soothe Bell right here. That way it can get a little bit more friendlier with us because I do want to evolve it into a, an Espeon at some point. And it's still daytime. It's still daytime, so I kind of want to do it right now. I'm going to give Cinder the experience share, have it leveled up to level 30 right here. And let's move on right here. Let's do it. Come on. Who's next? We got three more trainers right here. And this guy is looking at us. And he's going to be like, uh, I just got back to Olivine. So how about the Pokemon battle? We can do this. We can have a Pokemon battle. So as you can see, Sailor Eugene lost the battle. Coming with this Poliwhirl right here. Poliwhirl looking all mean and everything. So let's go with a quick attack. 
And wow, half HP. This relic is a pretty good Pokemon right here. Look at that. Look at you, Relic. Level 25. And well, he's gonna be coming out with Eradicate, so let's go ahead and use that Hercules right there. All right, bring it, bring it, break, break, brick, break, does the brick break. That's how you do it. Alrighty, and Cinder grows a level 28. Wow, people are just like rolling levels now. Man, I, I wish we could have done that back when we were uh, against the gym leader. And here's that Krabby. So here we got Thunder Shock. For the win, suck on those lemons, Krabby. Look at that. Alrighty. And yet, I was kind of hoping for an evolution. I really was. Alrighty, so let's go ahead and uh, battle this guy right here. See what he has to say. Do, 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 do. Is it okay to brag about my Pokemon? It kind of is. If you love your Pokemon, then brag about them. Okay, so here we go. Pokemon Derek coming out with his Pikachu. And, well, kind of like a preview, Pika uh, Pokemon Let's Go Pikachu and Eevee. And that attack does it well, so here we go with a quick attack. And there we go, this Pikachu has been defeated. Look at that. Derek, you cannot brag about your Pokemon anymore. And, well, I am not going to... I am not going to take your phone number because, yeah, I do not want to talk a lot about Pokemon. I only need Pokemon trainers. They can actually help me with the, with the kind of stuff that you guys have. So, let's go ahead and switch out to Nessie right here. And, well, Mom is calling us again. And this lady right here is pissing me off because she won't look at me. Come on, give me attention. There we are. Alrighty. Let's go. We're going up against Ruth. And she's got herself a female Pikachu. So let's go ahead and do this body slam attack. We might get paralyzed, but it's okay. Look at that. Okay. So that was an easy battle, I guess. Okay. All right, let's move on. Um, there might be some Pokemon right there that you can actually capture, but I don't think that that's been important right there. Now, if you go right here, use Headbutt to shake Pokemon out. Different kinds of Pokemon, of course, will you will be finding. And would you look at that? We're here in Olivine City. Finally! It's about dang time, and before you move on anywhere, this guy! Oh my god, here we go again. Dun, dun, dun. You again! There's no need to be alert. I don't bother with wimps like you. Speaking of weaklings, the city's gym leader isn't here, and is supposedly taking care of a, a sick Pokemon at the lighthouse. <laughs> Boo hoo. Boo hoo! Just let the, the sick Pokemon go. A Pokemon that can't battle is worthless. Why don't you go train at the lighthouse? Who knows? It may make you a bit better, a bit better trainer. Eh, yeah, well, flipping you off. I'm flipping you off, Silver. I hope you know that, jerk. Okay, so that is uh, that right there. And of course, our mom is gonna keep on calling us relentlessly. Oh my god. In real life, my mom doesn't call me this much, but it is what it is. So. Here we are in all of Mine City, guys. In the next episode, we will be going into the lighthouse to see what is going on. What can we do to save the day? So, thank you guys again for watching another episode of my Pokemon Heart Gold. Uh, we'll be back for another episode. See you guys.